Wow. This kind of fit makes me so proud of my green passport. One master hope your master to Chuku Ugoji. Earlier in the month of May 2023, he made the best graduating student of Loyola Marymount University of, the, of, of Los Angeles in the USA. He became the valedictorian of the university for this year. That's the story we're going to share right now with you. And as a valedictorian, he had the privilege to deliver the farewell speech at the graduation ceremony. By the way, a valedictorian is someone that uh, had the highest graduating uh, the highest score as a graduating student in this particular set, okay? Usually higher institutions, that's who a valedictorian is. It was just very good to watch him project his Nigerian heritage and particularly her, identifying with his tribe. I was so, so, so proud of him. There are so many Nigerians out there in diaspora doing amazing things, doing amazing feats all over the world. Stories like this will help change our perspectives and we write the narratives for Nigeria. I would love for you to stay back and watch this video. He's a 22-year-old boy. His name is Obiora Somtochi Ugoji, an Igbo boy from Eastern Nigeria who has no English name or any foreign name at all. He's so proud of being a Nigerian. He started his valedictory speech with the phrase, Igbo Kwenu! Igbo Kwenu! A common greeting used in his dialect. He eulogized the Igbos throughout his speech. Wow. You need to watch this video, the video of his speech. It was mind blowing. It was really, really, really an awesome session. Congratulations to his parents for raising such a promising young man. Nigerians are brilliant and can compete globally. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I love for you to do well to. Subscribe to my YouTube page if you love this particular video and others like this that will be posting um, as we get to make them. My name is Tony Adokie and uh, I love for you to keep educating yourself. Education is key and knowledge empowers you. I love you. Introduce you to you the valedictorian for 2023, Obiama Ugorji. Wow. What an honor and special moment this is. I have the pleasure to stand before you today, but before we get started, it's a little bit warm up here, you know, I'm sweating a little bit. I refuse to sweat anymore this morning. Um, I would like to invite you all to help me feel a little bit more at home up here. Um, so you see, I am Nigerian. I am from the, thank you. I'm Nigerian. My family is from a tribe called the Igbo tribe. And in our culture, we often say the phrase, Ibo Kwenu, okay? So this essentially means endorsement, agreement. It refers to a bondedness and the collective strength that we all enjoy as a people. And I would like to invite you guys into that collective strength today. So when I say Ibo Kwenu, I would like you guys to respond back to me in quick affirmation. Hey, you guys do that for me this morning? Y'all got me? All right, let's try it. Ibo Kwenu. Hey. 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 Good job. Clap for yourself. It's good. <laughs> oh. What a good morning this is. I am beyond honored to have the opportunity to represent my peers, close friends, and family members on this stage today. I wish it were possible for me to invite each and every one of you up here to embrace the deep glory that we have all worked towards. Faculty that has dedicated their lives to enriching our minds while remaining committed to the Jesuit values that this institution holds dear. Facility workers that have worked tirelessly to make sure that this campus is a beautiful and safe environment for us to learn. 
staff that has regarded student interest as the highest priority today, we thank and honor you. As we have chased our dreams on this campus, we have kept goals and individuals at the forefront of our minds. Mom and Dad, four years ago, I stood in this field and I asked you to bless me with the opportunity to make you proud. And four years later, I'm in the same field and your son is valedictorian. Please join me in honoring those that have paved the way so that we can celebrate today. My resilient class of 2023, as we, have, as we have chased our dreams on this campus and worked hard, I just hope that as your family and friends are here today, you are filled with a deep joy that surpasses all kinds of understanding. A deep joy that is incorruptible by the woes that are commonplace with moving from the classroom into the workforce. I am here today to encourage a pause of the questions that ask, What's next? I'm a cow. 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 I'